Automation. Going to make another quick video on some of the new features of this strategy simulator Excel sheet. We added a few more betting progressions, and today I'm going to make a video on the lab we share. Uh, we have a handful more features that we're working on with the, the programmers, and, and once those are complete and this, this is completed, then I will be putting it out to the public. Uh, for today, we're going to use the Labouchere method. And I'm going to put a link to this video, Wizard of Odds. He does a real nice uh, job explaining the method, and I'm going to play around with it. So when I, I go to play, I'll do an explanation of how this betting progression works. But right now, let's just go through the, the uh, simulator. So the goal is going to be $1,000, $10,000 bankroll. $100 for the one unit bet, let's do 5000 for the table limit, we're not going to use the tie, but, but if we did, we'd pay it out 8 to 1, 75 rounds per shoe, and we use the La Boucher. To keep it simple, let's just bet on player, until we'll say 40 players, so we'll just do nothing but bet on player. Okay, so after, well we're starting with 10000 the goal is a thousand ending bankroll is eleven thousand so we achieve the goal in 13 hands i'm not going to go through this right now but i'll go through it when i start to play all right we won in 13 hands again all right, this time it looks like yeah, we do not have enough to make the next bankroll or the next bet in the progression so uh, this is a loss Goal is reached in 17 hands. 27 hands. Uh, we took a loss. And one more. We won in 36 hands. Pretty big bet. Okay, let's go to the simulator. Alright, so the same parameters. Sure, let's do over a thousand trials. Right, let's do player forty. Okay, so let's just check the count is a thousand and one, so a thousand results with the header, a thousand and one. So looking at this, it looks like you either you win, so five hundred eighty seven, so that'd be fifty eight point seven percent. These look pretty neat. either actually okay, so either you win your bankroll, there's no partial wins, or win win the complete goal. Or you take a pretty big, pretty big loss. So either it's going to go well for you, or you're going to take a pretty big loss. So, so 58.7, points will call it 59, but that's close to 60% win, 40% loss. For the fun of it, let's just double the bankroll. See what happens. So doubling the bankroll, we go to 610, so we go from base, basically 59% up to 61%. So 61%, if you double the bankroll, that's double the amount of money at risk. Either you win your complete goal, or you still take a pretty big hit, which these are pretty big numbers. Let's just do one more, let's limit the goal. Down to 500. Five hundred seventy-three, so fifty-seven point three percent. Let's just run again. So these are all coming out right around sixty percent win, forty percent loss, and the losses are pretty big. Actually, with the lower goal, looks like you can get some partial wins. Okay. So let's go over and actually play around. 
okay, so the, the way that the Labu chair works is, so on this Excel sheet, uh, this is going to represent one unit, two units, and three units. So what you do is you bet the two outside numbers, and if you win, you cancel them off the lists. And if you lose, you add them together and, and add them two to the list. So when I start playing, it'll become a lot more clear. And once you close out this betting line, you'll win this total number. So three, two, and one, that's six. You'd win six units if you successfully complete this. So, all right, so one plus three is four. So we're gonna start with you know, fresh shoe, just put 400 on player. So we're betting, so we bet four units and we lost. So now we're gonna, the new betting line is four. So now our two outside units are one in four. So that's 500, so let's bet 500. And we will, we bet 500 and we lost. So, one, two, three, four, five. So now our two outside numbers are one and five. That's 600. We got a tie. Actually, you know, let's switch over to banker. We're betting six. Okay, so we got, um, you know, I should have kept it on player, so when we finished out the the round, it would, it would be equal to this, to 600 profit, but it's going to be a little less with the commissions taken out. But okay, so we won six, so we're going to delete those two numbers from the betting line. So now we're down to, to these three numbers, so the two outside numbers equal six again, so we're going to bet six again. Let's just repeat that bet. And we lost, so we're gonna add that six to the outside. So the two outside numbers equal eight, so we're gonna bet eight. And we won. So now we're gonna take those two outside numbers off, that leaves us down to three and four. So when we add those together, it's seven. So, what are we doing? Yeah, let's just keep it on um, player. So let's bet seven. We got it. Actually, let's strike that down. We're betting seven. We lost. So now it is three, four, seven. So the two outside numbers are ten. So down to betting four. It's a little confusing, but okay, so let's bet four. Clear. Two, three, four hundred. We won. So ten thousand five hundred seventy. So you know we, we we bet four, we won, so we're down to nothing. So that cancels out. So three units, two units, one units is Six units, six hundred. So if we would have bet all player, that would be six hundred. But we lost some commissions. So that is the lobby share. Let's do. You know, actually, let's just keep this going. So after you win, what you do is you start another uh, betting line. Let's say we want to. You can start with whatever you want. So let's go two, three, four, five. So let's start with. You can start with whatever numbers you want. And essentially, if you want to win a thousand bucks, then you would have these numbers add up to a thousand. So what we're going to do is we're going to bet seven hundred. So what are we doing? Seven hundred. Okay. So now the betting line is two, three, five, seven. So the two outside numbers are nine. And let's go back. Okay, so we lost, so now we are two, four, five, seven, 
nine. So outside numbers are eleven. Let's do eleven on a player. Okay, we want to get to cross off those two outside numbers. We have to three, four, five, seven. Okay, so the outside numbers are ten. Nothing's dropping below this. Let's put 10 on Baker. And it drops. Okay, so. 3, 4, 5, 7, 10. Outside numbers equal to 13. Let's just keep player going. Right, we're moving. Okay, so we're at 3, 4, 5, 7, 10, 13. Okay, so now we're 16. Just keep the player going. Okay, so now we're at 3, 4, 5, 7, 10, 13, 16. So the outside side numbers equal to 19. Okay, so we get to cross off the 3 and the other outside number of 16, so we have a 4, 5, 7, 10, 13, we cross off that 16, so the outside numbers equal 17. Uh, let's just keep it on player. Okay, so now we're at 4, 5, 7. 17, so the outside number is equal 21. Okay, let's just keep that player. Okay, so now we are at 5, 7, 10, 13, 7, no, 17. Outside number is equal. 18. We'll just keep it on the player, keep it simple. Okay, so now we're down to 2, 7, and 10. We cross up these two outside numbers, so we're going to bet 17. Okay, we lost, so we're at 7, 10, 17. So we're at 24. Okay, the numbers get pretty big pretty quick. So. That's going to put a 31. Okay, so now we're going to go to, looks like, you know, we don't have enough to make the next bankroll. 34, 31. So, it uh, looks, next bankroll should be 38. We don't have that. Let's just bet it all. Okay, that was some good luck, but that's not what we were supposed to do. We were supposed to bet 38, we didn't, we bet 30, so our profit will not add up to the beginning of the bankroll units, but let's do a couple more rounds. So we're about 34. I guess we'll just keep banker going. Okay, we lost. 34. 
44. And so we should be betting 44. We don't have that, so uh, let's just put it all on play and close this one out. Okay, we won. That's cool. But all right, I'm gonna pause this. Uh, as you can see, uh, the bet, the units get pretty big pretty quick. And what we saw in the simulator, we went from 10,000 to 20,000. We really didn't get a big increase in, in percentage win. And after after playing, I think that's because the units they get so big so quick. So if you have a couple of losses, you're you start out really small and you're just betting a really large amount. So uh, that is the Labouchere. It is the newest betting progression added in. And stay tuned for more.